you can touch the shaft, it is locked. If the motor is without a brake, when power off, the shaft can be twisted. Here is a 220 volt power. Here is the motor cable, U, V, W, and P, and then this is the encoder cable. Correspond to these two amp connector. Just connect the male and the female plug. This is a single cap signal cable. You can see we send you a CN1 connector. Need you to weld it according to your requirement. So we need a 24 volt power supply for the CN1 connector. DO4, which is pin 6, needed to connect to the release coil, which is 14, and comb, which is pin 23, connect to the 24 volt power supply, negative, and the DC 24 volt, which is pin 31, connect to the 24 volt power supply, positive. These two, relay 9 and 12, is normal on, connect to break, positive, and negative. These two, relay 5 and 8, is also normal on. Connect to the 24 volt power supply, positive and negative. Then we power on. Now the status is without enable. Then we need to set the motor to enable. Set P098. To 1. To unlock the brake. You can see the relay is on. Light is green. We can manually set the driver to R, negative 20, to so drop test it. 